I put up TV antennas in my town, and, and this is the program that I use to do it. My channels is already uh, put in there. Now, once you have them in there, they'll stay in there, and you don't have to do a channel scan every time. But uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go right here. I'm going to show you how to scan. All right, go right here to two devices. Now, I'm going to go to this 850 because I got two different tuners in mine. I got two different types of tuners. But I'm going to go right here to set up. Now, see this digital, this top one. I'm going to check that and then I'm going to hit next. And then I'm just going to leave that like it is. I'm going to hit next again. And now it's searching. I'm going to fast forward this part right here. Okay, this thing finally finished. You can uh, look through all this and look at your channels. I've been doing it a year and I see channels pop up all the time. I'm going to hit next. Pop up all the time that I've never seen. I'm going to hit next. Next again. And then go down here to OK. And then you have to click this TV button right here. Now let's go into let's go into the channel. It's taking its time about going to the channel. Okay, now uh now see this right here. This software comes with a signal meter. I'm gonna click that and then uh there's there's the signal meter. Now you can turn that antenna a little to the left, a little to the right, but you'll know when you got it dead on or if you need to move it or whatever. Now I'm going to go back here to the settings again. And all this stuff right here, uh, man, it, it comes already all uh, pre-figured. You don't have to worry about doing nothing. Uh, just, uh, did, well, this shows the channels. But you already know what channels you got, you know. And then, uh, this is where you look in capture, general. Like I say, you ain't got to worry about all this stuff. It's right, it, it's pretty simple. Now, if it wasn't already prefigured, it, it might be pretty rough. Okay, and see, this thing's also a DVR. And I, I hadn't hardly ever used it. But, uh, see this little red button right here? Uh, Alright, now it's recording that now. And one time, I recorded the halftime Super Bowl show. And YouTube liked to throw me off of YouTube because I didn't have permission to, you know, to do that. I mean, I didn't know no better. Alright, I'm going to stop that. Now, you see right here where this folder is? Now, this is where, if you want to, uh... Well, this is what I this is the this is the video that I just done right here. That's the video I just recorded there for just a few seconds. Okay. Uh now and see I had see it ain't on TV right there. I'm gonna click TV and now it's going back to the antenna. And then uh Right here is the way you turn the channel. Now, you can hit this button up here, this, and you can hit this thing up top right here, and it'll go full screen. I'm going to hit escape and get, and get it back like it was. Uh, you can take a snapshot. You know, I don't know what that's good for. Let's see what this OSD is. Okay, nothing. Here's the volume. Here's the mute. This software comes with a little antenna. And you can take this laptop with you uh, on vacation or whatever. If you're a truck driver, you can take it with you and you can watch TV. And then you also, uh, it's got a, you know, you can uh, hook up a, like an indoor TV antenna. I got one of them, uh, like a, as seen on TV is the name of it. 
this software I'm using, it'll do more than what I showed you. If you got any questions, just put it on my comments there, and I'll try to answer it the best way I can.